the Halloween story. I have no idea how I will escape all these monsters in this house. I was, I was surrounded by vampires, mummies, two Frankensteins, four werewolves, one invisible man, and five mummies. It was impossible. I was a feast for the undead, and my blood was boiling with fear as I ran into the dark room of the house where blood and bones plastered the old walls and floors that reeked with foul dead funk. They drove me to that depth of a pit of a room, and my fear did not inform me that it was by their design. Somebody help me, I screamed. I have to escape. My life and eternal soul depended on it. But how? I had no weapons, stakes, crosses, silver bullets, or magic potions. The old house floor crept louder and louder as these children of evil followed me to carve me into their unholy ram. As I moved back and back into the darkest corner of the room, still they saw me, smelt me, their feasts of offerings. I screamed, ah, ah, somebody help me. Along in the darkness, still screaming until my deep consciousness kicked in and I willed myself to wake up from my horrible and terrible nightmare which had me in a cold sweat. I got up from bed and turned the television off and then turned all the lights in my bedroom on. And then I wrote this fast fiction Halloween story that you are now listening to. The end, the end, the end.